everybody welcome back i hope you are having a great day as you can all see i am changing the style of my videos a little bit because obviously it's not my desk and my hands and whatever because i don't want to show you my dumb drawing tablet that i never use on my desk and whatever because i don't think that's very entertaining so instead i have a beautiful picture of myself by trev show if you want to check him out on instagram is he he is a great artist and i definitely recommend you go check out his work and leave him a like and comment if you do tell him that i sent you and yeah but without further ado i think i should explain what i am going to do with this video so this video as i'm sure you saw in the title is going to be kind of a retrospective on where i've been where this channel and i am going to go as a person and what you can expect from me and what i'm expecting to do myself so without further ado let's get into it now i'm sure most of you know if you've kept up with my channel somewhat at all that my upload schedule is basically as good as i, I don't know a 90 year old grandpa with dementia trying to upload youtube videos i do not upload at all now the reason for that is part one i'm young and i have things to do in my life i have people in my life sports activities school yes i am still in school and everything and all of that is just a lot to keep up first of all along with another hobby of making youtube videos online and everything and that's why if you do want to keep up with me more um you really should go follow me on instagram because i am more active on there so yes this is a plug to my instagram go follow it at plastic in a box but that's not what this video is about so yes i have been away and i have had a horrible upload schedule but i do hope to turn a new leaf and start to upload more because there's this thing that's kind of hard to describe but the best way you can describe it is burnout and a lack of creativity and even though i'm sure you're saying plastic in the box how the hell can you get burnout from opening figures and making like five minute youtube videos which i do think i did mention in one of my older videos somewhere i don't know because <laughs> i remember having this conversation with myself but the thing is it's just like it's hard to motivate yourself sometimes and i know like artists other content creators and everything have most people even watching this video you've all had a time where it's just hard there's just a lack of motivation and well i don't like to be one to make excuses for things that is what i'm going to chalk it up to now for the future of this channel i am hoping to get a better upload schedule that's probably going to consist of one video a week two maybe but I am free most of the summer. Well, not most of the summer, but the summer does give me a lot more time. So going into it, I should rebuild my channel and start to grow more as a content creator and as a person. So yeah, that's the gist of what you can expect. Probably around one video a week, I'm going to try to branch out into different content. Maybe do Funko Pop videos, YouTube's, Makeship, and I'm going to do Funko Pop hunts going to do different tier list videos fact factual videos all everything above but with that you are also going to probably see not a decrease in quality but an increase in quality yes i am drag do make my videos better than me sitting at my desk with my freaking what is it a wacom 16 tablet opening funko pops and shit i i want to actually I want to grow my community. I want to create a community of my own, and I want to just create content for people and entertain people. And really, that's what I have a passion for, is just to entertain people. And if I can do that, then I've, I, I don't know, I'll, I'll die a happy man. I've lived a good life. But all I really want to do with this channel is to entertain all of you and to get all of you if you're having a bad day or something to watch more of my videos maybe laugh a little bit learn something i don't freaking know but just to somehow entertain you and raise your spirits 
and however that may be i'm not sure that's honestly up to you all but that is what you can probably expect from me and what i'm going to try to do going into the rest of this year so without the way i don't think there's too much more i talk about expect a video soon let's get on to the prototype unboxing all right guys with that with all that out of the way um welcome back to my ugly desk and hands and here is the prototype let me zoom this out a little bit so you can get a better view don't mind all the other junk and crap shit whatever on my desk um but yeah here's the prototype i hope you all like this review um if you want to see here's the box so the bottom is just plain white the sides is prototype going in the box a pretty cool design i like all the youtube's eyes prototype youtube's has always been a company to like put in care and dedication in the way they ship not necessarily how the figures get there because i cannot count how many times i've reached out to youtube support to get a new youtube's but i digress the, you get the memo here's the inside and i have already taken the figure out and everything it doesn't have my address it was on top um but if you want to see here's all the like bubble wrap and whatever it came in and here is the inside with the proto word prototype going around again and as you can see the u2 signature right there and the u2 size at the bottom um and also again i gotta give a shout out to my man todd and austin everybody working at u2s for sending me this amazing prototype thank you very much i do very much appreciate it it's it's been a dream of mine ever since i started collecting the air prototype and it honestly it feels surreal to finally get it um but anyway um as long as you didn't read the description and everything i am now going to show the prototype i got and that is drum roll please i won't die <laughs> now i watch um I watch, uh, RT Game. Oh my god, I forgot his name for a second. Jesus. Um, I, for I watch him sometimes. Not a whole lot. But I think this figure has a really cool design. Um, I like the armor on it and everything. And if you want to take a better look at it, here it is. You can see his hair, his armor, his weapon, and his facial, facial features, sorry. And on the bottom, it's printed on youtube.com and the YouTube's logo. Now, I'm not sure if they have it printed on just for the prototype, like how they normally have it actually in the mold. Um, I'm not sure if that's for the prototype or if that actually came with the figure. But if you guys have the figure I won't die, let me know in the comments so I can figure that out. Um, however, I will try to get another I won't die off of eBay or Mercari or something, so I can do a prototype versus real figure comparison in the future, which I think would be a pretty cool video. Um, but yeah, here's the figure, here's the bottom, and yeah, that is pretty much it. Um, yeah, I hope you all very, oh, Jesus Christ, um, <laughs> sorry, by the way, if I sound really sick, I've been congested and coughing for like a week, I swear to God, I'm like Walter White or something with lung cancer, um, but anyway, I hope you all liked the review and also i hope you all are excited for the future of the channel Ch i'm dyslexic i hope you all are excited for the future of the channel and yeah so without further ado thank you all for watching have a great day make sure to like subscribe and comment if you feel free to and yeah i hope you all have a great day thank you and good day.